Morale patches are a great way to personalize and customize and show off your team. But you only have so much room on your loadout, so what do you do with all the ones you collect? Well, you could put it on your rifle case, if that rifle case is an EMG battle cruiser. This is the Evic.com Battle Cruiser Hard Shell Rifle Case. And this is possibly one of the biggest items I've ever reviewed. Um, the external dimensions are 40 and a half by um, 16 and a half by six and a half inches. And it is a hard polymer case um, with uh, metal latches and weighs approximately uh, um, 13.7 pounds. So, uh, in the realm of hard shell rifle cases, that actually is lightweight if you uh, if you've ever uh, had to carry a hard shell case. But the advantage of this over, say, a canvas or typical uh, range bag, uh, range rifle bag, is that this is definitely going to protect your um, your valuables, your uh, airsoft guns, your real steel, uh, much better than a uh, than a canvas padded bag. And this is uh, TSA approved. Uh, it's got, as I mentioned, it has um, metal latches here, and it has uh, it has a lock um, ho lock holes. You can attach uh, TSA approved locks in here, and you can take uh, your firearms with you uh, with appropriate uh, following appropriate rules uh, traveling uh, in an aircraft. Uh, and of course, check with uh, the TSA and uh, your airport and your airline before uh, traveling with firearms. And of course, keep all your firearms uh, unloaded when traveling. So let's take a look at this bad boy here. And inside, we have an ample amount of padding here. And these are Velcro panels you can attach. And we'll attach those in a bit. But let's just take a look at this padding here. We've got uh, an egg crate style and we have a solid foam. This is about an inch and a half, uh, or inch and a quarter, each of those pieces here. And on this side, we've got, oh gosh, uh, about probably two inches and an and a inch and a quarter uh, panel here. And these ones are perforated, uh, so the you can customize, you can punch out these squares and fit it exactly to whatever uh, rifle or piece of equipment that you want to put in here. I mean, you could travel with, like I said, real st real firearms where there's probably enough room here depending on your, what kind of rifle. You could put fit in two rifles, uh, some mags, uh, or if you are traveling um, with uh, some expensive recording equipment, uh, a keyboard or DJ equipment or who knows what, you could all fit in in here and you can customize it with these uh, punch out uh, square foam. Uh, totally customize it. Um, definitely, definitely rugged and durable. And I'll be giving this away in a fundraiser raffle soon. But in the meantime, I'm going to attach these fun Velcro panels to the front of this and see. Um, these are for attaching um, uh, hook and loop style patches or what what have you or name uh, name tape. Uh, so you can customize uh, your the front of uh, your case. So let's do that next. All right. When attaching any sort of adhesive, you want to uh, clean the surfaces off with a bit of uh, alcohol. And I'm using 70% isopropyl alcohol here. And that just cleans off any um, residue that might be on the outside of this so that the adhesive has a good clean surface to attach on and you can minimize any peeling later because there's always a little bit of, of um, sweat from any sort of plastic or polymer and those are because it, oh, plastic is a polymer product and you could use any sort of degreaser but I find alcohol to be very convenient. And of course, nowadays, with uh, since uh, the pandemic, you can, there's a lot of alcohol now. So, higher the alcohol content, the faster it will dry off. So, we'll wait for that to dry off in a bit. All right, we've let this dry off. Now, let's just attach these panels here and we'll roughly place them where they're gonna go. 
Okay. Oh, by the way, it does come with instructions, though I don't really think you need them in this case. All right, so let's start with this one. This one's just peel off. that. You can use your own technique for aligning this. Just be aware that this is like 3M style, super sticky, icky. Unintentional. It's very accidental. Let's hope that that doesn't cause a weak point later. And there you go. Now all you need to do is attach uh, your patches. Let this um, let this cure for you know a good half hour or so, and you should be good to go. The EMG Battle Cruiser is a do-it-yourself customizable case from the inside out. Quite literally. If you're interested in buying this case, you'll find product links and more information on my blog, MoondogIndustries.com. You'll find a link in the video description. And if you got something out of this video, hit that like button and leave me a comment. And most importantly, subscribe to the channel. It's free, and you're directly telling the algorithm the kind of videos you want to see more often. So, thanks again for watching. Moondog, out. Hey, if you enjoyed this video, please share it on forums, Facebook, Reddit, TikTok, Instagram, Twitter, MeWe, whatever social media you're on. And if you want to see all of my videos, check out MoondogIndustries.com. <laughs>